Hello. So, taking a break from the engine right there to uh, start a new project. All these little fellows rather excited to get out of that box. I've got a hive sitting on a table up in the darkness up there and I just need to chop this up and make a frame to hold the whole hive off the ground so the beetles don't get at the bees. Uh, I think I'll put the beehive right here between the quince tree and the green gauge tree. What about an arm for the width? Now I just need a level bed for the hive to sit on. Okay, so I don't have a bee hood, but what I do have is a nice hat and a mosquito net. Yes, that shall do nicely to keep the little things off me. Okay, now this is the fun part. So here's the angry nuke of live bees, which have been chilling out for an hour or so. Pop them here. Okay. Hive ready. And normally it's five, I think it's five normally frames, so put these back in a lot less than that. Flyers to reach in there. They all seem pretty chilled out, so that's not too much trouble. Yeah, I know bees, go on, shoot you. Yeah, they're, uh, they glued them in there pretty well. Yeah, 
we are. There's the train. Drop this, this would be bad, but okay, that's those two both coming off at the same time. I joined the two frames together a bit. There we go, good grip on that. So far, the bees are fairly well behaved. I haven't been stung yet. That's amazing, Dibby. Ah. See, they've domesticated animal bees. It's like a goose. A goose may bite you and try to murder you, but only some times of the year. And most of the time, the goose just leaves you alone. You normally deserve it when the, the goose is attacking you. Yeah, it's given up attacking me. Ah, exactly. We, we never thought that day would come, did we, Mum? Everything okay over there, Gushu? How are the eggs coming? Not long now, Goosh. Not long now. Once the lady goose is sitting on eggs, tend to behave themselves, the male goose. goose getting broody. Yeah. Okay, we got all four frames in the hive. Yes! Wow. It's weird having the net on your face because you can't just blow the bee away. I can see the advantage of not having the net on. Oh, I'll just have to shuck these in, aren't we? Boy. No stinging bee. close up on that bee. Look at that lovely bee. <laughs> um, I want to brush those bees so I don't squash them. You always end up squashing a few bees apparently every time you open the hive. Oi, city bees. Gathering for a bit of conversation? Yeah. Hanging about on the outside of the hive. I wouldn't worry about them if they're not doing any harm. Yeah, as long as the queen isn't in there. Has the queen got a painted spot so you can tell which she is? Aye, if she was outside of the hive, we'd know about it. Oh. Um, they'd all just be in a mass, all the bees on the You've outside. Got a little collection of bees on you. Oh, they're moving when you move. <laughs> yeah. Okay, lid on the hive. Come back in uh, a month, I think. Where's the door? Um, it's down there. That little slit? Yep. These are small. Hmm. There we go. I can take the list up off now. Ah. We've, we've got, well, you've got one on your shoulder, Dougie. Whee! Yeah. Better give this um, gooseberry tree a, a bucket of water. It's been fairly dry. Mm. There we go. Uh, green gauge.